Hi, I'm Emily White, and you're watching GSMC Documentaries. The following program will be about the techniques and physics behind long jumping. And the trumpets, there you go. For long jumping, the jumper must first run down a 40 meter strip, and as they approach the mat, they should see a line. And with their most sturdiest foot, they should jump from the line onto the mat. This jumper is demonstrating incorrect technique because when in the air, both their arms and legs are not in front of their body. This decreases the distance jumped. This jumper is demonstrating correct technique because when in the air, both her arms and her legs are straight out in front of her, which increases the distance much, much more. To find the force of a long jumper, you must have at least three known values, mass, distance, and time. Then you use three different equations to find the force. Distance over time equals velocity, velocity over time equals acceleration, and Newton's second law. The first equation gives you the velocity, and in this instance, the velocity is 2.16 meters per second. Then you plug it into the second equation, velocity over time equals acceleration. That gives you an acceleration of 2.88 meters per second squared. You then plug it into the last and final equation, which gives you the force. You take the mass, which is 578 kilograms, and you multiply it by the acceleration, 2.88 meters per second squared, and it gives you a force of 1,664.6 newtons. This is a graph that shows the correct jumpers, projectile, and velocity. The blue dots represent the trajectory, and the red dots represent the velocity, which is the slope of her position time graph. Here it tells you that her time is 0.75 seconds and her displacement is 1.62 meters. I know that her displacement is 1.62 meters because it is the area under the velocity. So let's recap. You know that your arms and feet should be in front of you and not pointing downward. And you also know how to find the jumper's force. Although there are more factors that contribute to a good jump, these three main ideas help you further your knowledge of both the sport and the physics behind it. And the trumpets,